1998, government introduced the decentralization policy with the aim of taking services closer to the people. The Lens Reform Ministry says it wants to ensure that operations resort directly under regional councils for speed service delivery and proper monitoring and supervision. The minister, Utoni Nyoma, says the exercise is in line with the country's decentralization policy, which strives to ensure economic, cultural and socio-economic development. It is recognized that due to the proximity to their constituents or communities that they serve, regional and local governments are in a better position to identify and address the needs of the people they directly serve. Nyoma believes this will provide people at grassroots level an opportunity to participate in decision making. The decentralized offices are in the Omsati, Ohangwena, Oshana, Kunene, Komas and Karas regions where the staff members will now report directly to the regional councils. There are more functions that have been designated for decentralization and more will be decentralized to us faster if we demonstrate how well we are managing the functions and the resources that have already been decentralized to us. While appealing to other ministries to follow suit, Urban and Rural Development Minister Sophia Shaningwa called for accountability and commitment among the staff. We don't need to formulate, uh, discuss issues and then have to send them to government, because, I mean to, to, to the central government, because we can take decisions locally. And it will also assist us then to identify problems, um, engage the community directly, ourselves, and uh, come up with solutions. And I'm very much happy that this function of, business, of lens has been decentralized to the region. I believe that uh, we will be able to address our issues at the regional level and then see to it that matters are being addressed mostly on the region. The transfer of functions to other regions will follow soon. Jeff Tashihumino, NBC News, Venduk.